Hi there, this is Jeff from CameraCraft, Canada Day just around the corner. I'd like to share some tips for photographing fireworks. Now, first of all, you're going to want to have a nice sturdy tripod as well as a cable release. The reason why is because you will be dealing with longer shutter speeds. Next, you want to set your camera to manual focus and manual exposure. The reason why you want manual focus is because the autofocus system does tend to have a lot of difficulty focusing in low light situations. The next would be your aperture. Now when choosing aperture, a lot of people tend to start with 2.8, but you actually want to do quite the opposite. The reason why is because the fireworks do emit a lot of light. I find to start anywhere between f8 to f16 is a good place to start. Another great thing to consider when shooting fireworks is the shutter speed. The reason why is because you will be dealing with movement, you're going to want a nice long shutter speed. A good place to start will be the bulb mode. The reason why is because when you are in bulb mode, you can hit the shutter speed on the cable release and it will stay open until you release it. And also feel free to experiment with timed shutter speeds such as 2 seconds or above. The last thing you want to consider would be your ISO. Um, you want something generally low, approximately 100, just to get a crisp, clear image with the least amount of noise. And if you follow these few steps for shooting your fireworks, you'll end up with some great shots. That's, my name's Jeff and that's your tip for photographing fireworks.